Hi friends, welcome back to Arc Tutorials. This is MongoDB full tutorial series for beginners. In today's episode, we are going to learn how to delete documents from collection. This is part of the CRUD operations that we will usually do on documents for using our Node or Express APIs, right? So create, read, update, delete. In the previous episodes, we have learned how to create a document, how to insert a document, how to read, how to update. Today we are learning how to delete documents from collection. This is part 12 of the MongoDB full tutorial playlist. The playlist link is in the description box below. Make sure you check it out. And there are around 21 tutorials that I have planned in this particular series. If you have any doubts, just ask me in the comment section below. I'll be happy to answer them. All right, so this is the part 12 of the MongoDB full tutorial playlist. And we'll learn how to delete documents today. Um, like I do in most uh, hands-on examples, I will show you both with graphical user interface, which is Compass app, and also with Visual Studio Code by running and executing the commands. Let's get started. So the focus on today's episode is to learn how to delete documents from collection. So there are multiple ways to delete documents. Um, if you remember the previous episode where we did find one and delete, right? So that was the first step we did while deletion, right? You can find a particular document and delete it as well. But there is a dedicated methods which are only uh, for there to for us to use to delete a document from collection. Right? So there are two methods. One is delete one, which will which will find all the documents in the collection, right? And then it will delete, right? So delete one. Then there is delete many. What it does is it will find multiple documents and delete them. But remember, this is a dangerous one because if you pass empty parameters to delete many, it will delete all the documents in the collection, right? So never ever do that. Never ever use delete many, right? That's scary. That's um, that's risky. If you don't pass the correct parameters, you might end up losing all the documents. So in interviews, a lot of people are asked the questions. Um, is it encouraged to use delete many? How do you use it? And what is the what happens when you pass an empty curly brace? So these are questions to trick you, right? So the answer is if you pass empty curly braces, which means delete all, right? Delete all documents in the collection, which obviously nobody wants, right? So you should tell them, you should answer them that we should not pass empty curly brace. In fact, at all times, try and avoid delete many as method because it's dangerous, it's risky. All right, so that being said, let's get into hands-on. Uh, let me open Compass app. Okay, so here we are. So we learned how to do a query and find, right, in the previous episode. So to delete, just go over here, right? There is a delete uh, icon in the Compass app. So you can see here, right, and just click on it. It would say document flagged for deletion. Now when you click on delete, it would get deleted, right? Let me show you that. So document deleted, right? Now there is only four, right? This is through UI which is pretty straightforward and easy way, right? Now let me show you what happens in, right? So how to delete documents in MongoDB. So the, the method that will run is delete one and there is delete many. That's what uh, we'll learn today. So let's see first the database we are using, testing DB, which is here refresh so we have four documents inside leads right so here i'm saying db leads dot so the moment you hit tab you see two these two methods which come up so i'm saying delete one right and delete one and we'll pass a query to it right so let's say address is new york right so let's do it here address new york and so it says acknowledge true deleted count one, which means it has it is this record is now deleted. Let me refresh it here. Now you see only three records. The first one is gone. The New York thing is deleted, right? So this is using delete one, right? Now let me show you db dot leads dot delete many, right? So now this is extremely risky, guys. Uh, uh, so this is uh, let me show you the condition. So if you see here there is is active false 
is active false right so these two i want to delete so what happens um, there are times when you have inactive accounts in your system you want to clean up right so you can run this command and what it would do is it will go find documents wherever there is matching is active is false it will delete them right let's go ahead and run them it says acknowledge true deleted count two that means last two are gone now refresh and only one is remaining because two are deleted right so this is how you can uh, pass query basically to delete many and right so you can pass multiple conditions to satisfy the document search and delete them right delete one will only delete one document right again this is based on criteria right cool so that is about uh, delete one and delete many so that covers our crud operations we have seen create slash insert documents into collections then we have seen how to read uh, documents from collections we have seen how to update documents from collections and finally today we learned how to do delete ones from collections right so that's completes our crud of documents right so that will bring us end of this particular episode but in the next episode we will start little complicated ones um, these are the tricky ones in mongodb which starts with querying aggregation limit sorting etc so a lot of work is pending uh, but we are soon heading towards it we have 21 tutorials we are halfway down the series i hope you're enjoying and liking the series if you do uh, hit the like button do um, share comment and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you so much